There are so many ways to set up your new Mac, but if you're just getting started, here are five of the most essential settings. First, let's get something really important out of the way, keeping track of your Mac. If it ever falls out of your grasp or you leave it in the library under some drunken fatigue, there is an easy setting that'll let you find out exactly where you left it. It's a good idea to enable Find My Mac. Like Find My iPhone, the free service lets you locate your missing Mac from any other device. By default, it's disabled. So to turn it on, head to System Preferences, then iCloud, and check the box next to Find My Mac. Give it permission, and you're good to go. Now, if you ever need to find your computer, just log into iCloud on another browser or use the app on another iOS device. Once you log in, a map will show up pinpointing the last tracked location of your Mac. Okay, with that safeguard in place, let's enable a few small but important features that'll make getting around your Mac a lot easier. For starters, enable tap to drag. Go to Preferences, then Accessibility Settings. Then head over to Mouse and Trackpad, then Trackpad Options, and Enable Dragging. You might also want to customize what shows up on your desktop. For instance, you can put your hard drive directly on your desktop for quick access. To do this, go to the Finder menu and choose Preferences. Then to the General tab and use these checkboxes to pick the items that'll appear on your desktop. And one more setting you'll be much more relaxed enabling, battery percentage. There is no use trying to figure out how much battery is left based on this symbol. So instead, click the battery symbol and head down to show percentage. Select it, and from now on, you'll see exactly how much power you have left. Now, if you want to be really productive on your Mac, get to know the gestures. Apple calls the trackpad the magic trackpad for a reason. It can do a lot more than just mouse around. So for instance, you can use two fingers up or down to scroll on any page. To zoom, double tap with two fingers or use the familiar pinch to zoom. To navigate, swipe left or right with two fingers and to view all open apps, swipe down with three fingers and pinch out with your thumb and three fingers to reveal the desktop at any point. Finally, if you have spaces or full screen apps open, use three fingers to navigate between them. Now that you have those essential tips down, you're one step closer to mastering your Mac.